In this video, we're going to be taking a look at a 256 gigabyte RetroPie image for the Raspberry Pi 4. This is based on the Nostalgia Trip version 2.0 by Damaso. Do not hook up the Ethernet cable to the device. Let it boot up first, let it do its auto expand, and then from there hook it up to your network. Use a Xbox 360 controller. I have a lot of the emulators already set up for that configuration. So let's hop into some of the systems. First up, we have our Arcade Classics section. After that is our Neo Geo section. We have here a Thomas Wave. After that is our Naomi system. Daphne's up next. Open Beats of Rage. Atari 2600. Atari 7800. Famicom. Famicom Disk System. After that, Nintendo Entertainment System. This is our Nintendo Hacks System. Super Famicom. Super Nintendo. Super Nintendo MSU-1, also known as Super Nintendo CD. What this does, it replaces the music with CD quality music. Super Nintendo Hacks. Uh, Game Boy. Game Boy Color. Game Boy Advance. Virtual Boy. After that, Neo Geo CD. Right here we have our PC Engine CD-ROM. Turbo Graphics 16, Super Graphics, Amiga, Sharp X 68000, PC FX, Scum VM, 3DO, PlayStation. In the PlayStation, we have 164 games. Here's our PlayStation Portable. I can tell you this I did take a tour of this image earlier. And I do see that they are using a different emulator to run this, and it is running a whole lot smoother. If games do run slow, I recommend just scaling down the res render resolution to about 1x or 2x. Sega Master System. Now we have our Sega systems. Genesis. We have our Genesis hack section. We have Game Gear. Sega 32X. Sega CD. Sega Saturn. Now, I've tested out some of these games and I have done a little bit of tweaks just to get the re internal rendering resolution a little bit lower. Definitely recommend checking this out. And I highly recommend this game right here, Golden Axe The Duel. It plays beautiful on this system. After that, this is where the system shines in my opinion. This is Dreamcast. This is using the ReDream emulator and it plays games like a dream. On the bottom right, you can see the amount of games. It has 101 games loaded into it. After that, we have our options suite. Many things to choose from, many things to check out. Here's what I recommend. Clear last played. If you're going to experiment with this image before maybe gifting it to a family member or a friend, I highly recommend running this. If you have any issues with the controller, I recommend going into the Easy Hacks Toolkit. And use this script right here, Factory Reset Controllers. Right here we have our power scripts for shutdown and system restart. And then up next is our all games list. This has everything listed. One easy trick is you can hit select and then hit left to right. And then you can go ahead and pick a letter and navigate. Sometimes I forget what system certain games belong to. So let's go like to the S. And then we will see every single game that starts with an S on the system. And then after that, these are Damaso's favorites. If you want to remove it, just hit the Y button to remove it. So anyways, I want to thank you guys for tuning in. Give it about a day or two. I'm going to send a torrent over to ArcadePunks and they should be listening on their website soon.